Uh, this is true with a review of the Air Force One um, 07, uh, level 8, I think it's the name. If you want this detail serial number, it's a uh, uh, CK7214. It also has, comes in black, but with this uh, rainbowish holographic iridescent swoosh pattern, it just goes better in white than black, personally. In my uh, that's my personal preference, I guess people might feel differently, but I just feel that the uh, the, this rainbow holographic switch just pops up better with a white background. Anyway, this is the 07 version. Uh, when you have the 07 at the back of Air Force Ones, they come with a full-length air sole. But do not confuse them with the kind of air strobel that you find in PG-4s. This is not the same kind of technology. It does have the full-length air sole, but just like the Air Jordan 2 Retros, you don't really feel that much. Maybe a little bit of a compression and cushioning at the heel. On the forefoot, you feel like there's really nothing much there. Uh, the insole is not exactly replaceable easily, so if you want to remove it and put something else in it, you're going to have some scrubbing to do because there will be some bits and pieces left glued to uh, the, the, the strobel board. So keep that in mind if you're thinking about hastily uh, jumping into that construction renovation work. Uh, the size, it fits to the size. Um, it's pretty heavy. Uh, for a size 9, it weighs close to 500 grams. And Whoa, 470 grams. That's pretty heavy. And it feels even heavier than that for some reason. Um, the iridescent swoosh is all around. It feels like it dropped into a, a, a warp zone or a black hole and then it came out at the, at the backside or something. But I, I like what they did here. It's nice. It's nice. Ah, just couldn't help but be attracted to it and just, yeah, just tell them to shut up and take my money. <laughs> uh, the Air Force One, they're pretty much the same whether they have uh, the insole, uh, the air sole and the heel and the forefoot, or they just have a bit of an air sole and the heel. It, there's, I guess the midsole is a little bit on the firm side, so you don't feel the kind of cushion that you feel from the Air Force One Comfort or Air Force One Comfort Lux or the Air Force One React. But they are soft on the heels for walking around, so they're not too bad. Um, uh, 07 is the one with the full length. Others, they have a separate air sole in the heel and the forefoot or just in the heel. That's something you should keep in mind. And when you see those little with little words that seems a little foreign, like uh, C-O-M-F-T or C-M-F-T or L-U-X or Lux, they usually do something a little bit different with a drop-in midsole with some unique materials, something you might want to keep in mind next time. But this is just a looker, not a performer, not the most comfortable shoe out there, but they do have an air sole that works and that you can feel in the heel.